Hey guys, welcome back to part number four. This is a, a, basically the second part of the advanced map, just showing you about events, wild Pokemon, and header. So I've just finished doing the other video. It's gonna take a while, uh, at least 12 minutes, because I'm using my proper editor. It's pretty cool. Anyway, so back on advanced map, I've just edited a tiny bit. Not much effort gone into that at all. Okay, so movement positions, don't give a shit about that. Events, okay. So on events, the thing I usually do is go show sprites and then untick hide over events, otherwise you won't see these things. Anyway, let's double up the size. Okay, so we see Professor Oak here. He's the guy, he's the Professor Oak that runs up to you as you step on the script thing. Okay, I'm just going to explain to you. Let's just go over to this big space over here. Okay, so you got, you're gonna, first you want to go down to amount of events. We've got four here, number of person events, number of signposts, the number of warps, and number of scripts. Um, so let's add two people. So we've got two, let's add three more signposts, some like that, more, a couple more warps, and a few more scripts. So we can change events. And now in the top up here, you'd have got loads of events, so I'm just going to zoom this out a bit. There we are. See the three um, orange S's are signposts, and you can see these over here on like your mailbox and such. Uh, the three green ones are scripts, like the ones at, at the exit of um, Pallet Town. That's when you first try and leave. Uh, let's just and the W's are warps, so when you step on that, you'll warp as if going through a door and then these two people, it's just a default sprite, are people okay okay if you don't have show sprites on you'll just get two P's okay so uh, scripts, you can't really do much without script editing which is going to be another video entirely so don't worry about it right now warps it are, easy, are easy to do I'll show you that in another video as well I'm going to go into the depth on each of these Signposts, that's like scripting again. Okay, so people here, you've got person event, picture number, so that's your sprite. So let's change the sprite to a guy fishing. Oops. This guy's going to be here fishing into a wall. He's pretty cool. Um, and then this guy is going to be, hmm, who should we make him? He's going to be a strange girl, actually, no. He's gonna be May, or she's gonna be May, and then here, okay, it's just give a movement type. So you got no movement, which is what we want to do. So let's go back to May again. Movement type, look around. So this is just looking around basically, and stuff like that. You got loads of them. Run, run, run on the spot. Hidden. So that means mirror player, standing, copy player. So just copy the player. So let's run around, counterclockwise. Okay. Run around counterclockwise, so she should be running and stuff. That uh, uh, movement, uh, just leave that alone. Like trainer, if you, this is for scripting as well, so just leave it at the moment. Um, script offset, that's the scripting. Okay, person ID, we'll look, talk about that later. Okay, so with these, you got script offsets as well. So that's all about scripting. Okay, so let's go first. Let's go back to map. Let's put some uh, wild Pokemon. Let's put some grass in here. Yeah, I think grass might be a pretty good addition. So let's make some grass. Where should we make some grass? Put some grass hmm, all around here. So basically, we'll just make a box of grass like that. You can do this for as long as you want. There you go. Let's add in some flowers and stuff. I don't know why I'm doing this. And these, make sure I can actually get through though. So these signposts and that. I won't mess around with moon positions and stuff. Let's just put like an entrance in here. Put an entrance there. Go back to events and we'll move one of these warps here. Here. Okay. So now I'll talk about that in another video. So she's gonna be running around in there. Let's go to wild Pokemon, okay? So we're gonna grass. Yep. Let's expand this. Uh let's just do grass and stick them again, okay. 
Okay, so type grass and counter ratio, let's just put 100%. So, um, let's say minimum maximum level 100. 100. and shit. Sorry for my swearing, it's just my natural instinct. Obviously if you're making a realistic hack, you're going to want to put these at realistic levels. Okay, so Pokemon. Let's in here let's find a Deoxys, yeah? Some Deoxys. How about oops that's already a Deoxy. Jirachi, pretty cool I suppose. Latios. Hmm, what are the Latios is after Latios? Uh, Rayquaza, I mean. Let's put Rayquaza. Let's just put the Hidden Legendaries in and that. No, it's what we're having at the time. Kyogre. Let's not put the Reggies in. Let's put some lovely Johto ones in. Celebi. Ho oh. -oh. All these question marks are strange. I just leave them alone. And Lugia. Let's put Entei and Raikou in because I like them. Entei. And. Uh, Raikou, here we are. Okay, so let's save that, yeah? Quick save. Why it's saved there? Header. So name Palette Town. Let's change the name to. Hello. I made this hack. Oops. You can't have too long a name. Okay, let's just call it Mega Poker Maniacs Crib. I didn't feel about like Crib. No. Mega Poker Maniac. Let's just do that. Change name. Mega Poker Maniac. This will change all the maps name map names in the same bank as this map you're working on. So you might want to make a new bank if you're making your own map. That's another video. Okay, it might take a while, so it's changed to make a Pokemaniac now. So let's just show village names on entering. Okay, music, let's change the music to You Caught a Pokemon. Cave, whatever, fight type, let's do a uh, Gym Star, no. Big Red Pokeball, whatever that means. Type, it's a village, let's say. Map, script, yeah, let's leave that alone. Tile sets, that's another video dimensions we talked about in the first video okay Rev weather as well you can change scripting you can heavy rain let's do that heavy rain with thunderstorm okay so heavy rain with thunderstorm yep that's pretty cool yep we've done everything now okay so we say that and now how far has this got still got ages to go let's open up the visual advance file open I didn't save it last time, so um, I'm just going to get forward to the right, place hey guys, where we are. Just got to the place, let's go outside. So here we are, and oh look, we're at Mega Pokemaniac, and it's raining. You might have just heard then, I'll just come out again. Um, I'll just turn the sound up and put the microphone to it so you can listen to the music that plays. you get that? Yeah, it was basically the music you get when you catch Pokemon. Okay, so let's just go down here. It's raining and flashing lightning like it said it would be. I've just mucked around with this a bit, put some stuff randomly. Yeah, let's not mess around with that. Okay, let's go up here. Put some more stuff we put in. So what, the f what was the first thing we did? We put a guy in here, didn't we? He's fishing. He's looking down. He's supposed to be looking right anyway. He's fishing. We can't really do anything because he stood there. Anyway, and there's ones there. So, oh look, and there's that random little girl. She's running around in catapults. So let's see what uh, Pokemon we would encounter. Oh my God! Look, it's a Latios. It's level 100. Unfortunately, I don't actually have any Pokeballs. That's not too good. Okay, so I have to run if I can. Okay, we can't escape because they're level 100. <laughs> Dragon ants. Yeah. I'll no, just try and do this. Oh, look, another one. It's because I've set such a high encounter rate, 255, I think it is, that 
literally every step you take you get a Pokemon a wild Pokemon battle. So that's pretty pretty um good if you wanna So oh look I just turned and there was a wild Pokemon battle. Look it's a Deoxys. Hello Deoxys. Ciao. Yep, so um I think that's gonna be it, yeah? Okay, so basically, yeah, I make another one on warps and I don't know if warps, yeah, I make another one on warps after this and scripting will be in the other one. So uh, yeah. Bye guys.